Yes, Mole, I reached only, but I don't know where the stairs are, no? I can see girls here, but hmm? such short clothes. This is what you also wear to this office. Yeah, yeah. One wind comes, her dress will also blow up. See? I mentioned that girl with a short dress and she hung up on me. Once I talk sense and she cannot talk to me anymore. I don't know what is wrong with kids these days, you know. Back in our day, we used to wear clothes to cover the body. Now, now they just disappear from places without any reason. Now recently, my daughter was talking about tube top. What is it? It is not sleeveless. It is not cut sleeve. It has no concept of sleeve. The dress is simply hanging from the body in permanent danger of sliding down. One meter of cloth across the chest. That is all they wear. Hmm. See, then there is my son. I have taught him very well how to spend money. I told him buy some gold, invest in some property, wear silk. If waste comes to waste, you can at least sell your gold, sell your land and feed yourself. What does he do instead? Wear torn jeans. He wants to spend money in looking homeless. Already, I don't know what the future holds, okay? Then one day I told my daughter, Molai, listen. All these clothes that you wear in the name of fashion, no? These are worn by fishermen inside their lungi. All you are doing is wearing it outside. You only tell me, no? How does it look nice? That is not even the funny part. The funny part is that small piece of knicker, it costs 2000 rupees. Now for 2000 rupees, I can buy a full jeans, no? Rather wear that full jeans for 2000 rupees. When it gets sold, just cut it off and make it your shorts. But if I say that, I don't know fashion. And you know, this fashion can be one funny business. I saw this girl on that internet. What is it called? Ah, Facebook. She is wearing my sari blouse. She is wearing jeans and she is calling it crop top. Hmm. It means you give any stupid thing a fancy name, it becomes fashion. Now see, I told my daughter, don't go around spending on all of this. I have a lot of old blouses, cotton and silk, both lying in my cupboard. Wear it. Look at my hair. It is black, no? My hair has managed to stay black even after having two children in their twenties. You know how? I have massaged my scalp with coconut oil twice a week without fail. I tell my daughter to do it, she laughs right now. What does she do? She colors her hair black, sometimes pink, sometimes blue. Hmm. I am telling you, by the time she has children, she and I both will look like grandmothers to that child. Now see. Pierced ears, I understand. Pierced nose, okay. But pierced eyebrows, tongue, chin, what is going on here? Now last year, my brother had come from America. We were sitting and having dinner at home in Kerala. Their son had this metal hanging from his eyebrow. My father is an old man. He does not know all this. He saw this hanging from his uh, eyebrow and just pulled it out. He thought it was dirt. What else will you think? You only tell me. Now see, if you like this video, then go like it, share it, comment on it. I have to go meet my daughter. 